This video will focus on using the Wayside Publishing Learning Site with the Schoology Thin Common Cartridge, or TCC, integration. It will provide a brief overview of the TCC import structure, as well as highlight the instructional use of the TCC integration, creating a task for grades passback, working with various activity types, reviewing student submissions, and providing feedback. For more information on setting up your Wayside Publishing Learning Site TCC integration, please visit the Wayside Publishing Schoology Integrations page to find helpful tutorials and guides. Content from the Learning Site will be contained in pre-populated folders after importing an IMSCC file. Due to the size of the imported file, we recommend using a sandbox course with a TCC integration and then moving content into your instructional course as needed. You are able to copy content to multiple sections of the same level course. You can also rearrange and rename content links to customize your course. Let's look at a few of these folders now to help you get started. To learn more about each of the folders, please see our integration guide. The Flex Text folder link provides you and your students access to the digital version of your Wayside text. The Grades folder link is how you and your students will access task submissions and scores. Teachers have access to all student scores. Students will only see their own task submissions, scores, and feedback. Each unit folder contains links to unit content and matches the structure of the FlexText. Teachers can add a unit folder to an instructional course or a sandbox course, moving only selected activities and resources into the instructional course as needed. The integrated portfolio allows students to self-assess their progress and demonstrate understanding. The Classroom Forum is an engaging and interactive space that allows for community building and sharing resources. In addition, there are folders focused on supporting instruction and student learning. The Resources folder contains instructional resources such as rubrics, proficiency resources, graphic organizers, and more. The Learning Tools folder provides a variety of instructional approaches that can be filtered by mode, proficiency level, and more. The Toolkit provides built-in world language methodology and pedagogy training at any time. The Wayside Learning Site offers many different instructional resources and activity types. We will focus on creating assignments, reviewing student submissions, and providing feedback for three common digital activity types, tasks, forums, and documents. Tasks include multiple choice, close activities, audio or video recordings, written responses, file upload, and more. The classroom forum, unit forums, and forum activities allow for interpersonal communication, sharing learning, adding external content, and extending interaction. Our classroom forum, which is its own link, could also be a great resource for community building and classroom communication. Documents are fillable PDFs that can be accessed directly on the learning site, downloaded, or accessed from a link. They could be completed and submitted digitally or be printed for in-person use. Let's first focus on assigning and reviewing task activities. Task activities provide multiple attempts for student improvement and can be set up for grades pass back with a Schoology TCC integration. To set up a task for grades pass back, you will first need to locate the task in an imported folder. Then, select Edit from the gear menu and choose Enable Grading. The task will now appear in your Schoology gradebook. Tasks on the learning site are out of 100 points, but will adjust to the value you enter on the Schoology assignment when the grade is passed into your Schoology gradebook. The TCC integration provides access to the learning site gradebook through a link in the Imported Grades folder. 
This is where you and your students will review task submissions. By default, the filters are not all selected. You and your students will need to select the Not Assigned but Attempted by Students filter under Activities in order to view completed task activity submissions. You will use the Learning Site Grading and Feedback window to review tasks. In the Grading and Feedback window, you have the ability to provide written, audio, and video feedback to students, adjust grades, remove attempts, navigate between students, see submission details, and use the highlighting tool on written student work. When you set up a task activity for grades passback, the score will appear in the Schoology gradebook. Auto-graded task scores will appear immediately after submission. Manually graded task scores will appear after a score is entered for the task in the Learning Site Reviewing window. In order to review student submissions, manually grade, or make adjustments, you will need to use the link in the Imported Grades folder to access the Learning Site Gradebook. Click on the title of the assignment to view all student grades and additional details. Click on the Grade button to open the Reviewing window. To go directly to the Reviewing window from the Learning Site Gradebook, click on a student's score. Your students will use the Imported Grades link to review their submissions and any feedback you have left. They can also use this link to add evidence to their portfolio. Now, let's move on to assigning and reviewing a forum activity. Forum activities encourage interpersonal communication and build classroom community. If you choose to grade a forum, you can set it up just like a task activity. You can enable grading on a forum activity by selecting Edit from the gear menu, and then selecting Enable Grading. Forum activities will be manually graded. If you choose not to grade a forum, you can simply provide students with access to the content link located in an imported folder. If you enabled grading on a forum link, then you can view student submissions by either clicking on the title in the gradebook to open the assignment, or accessing it directly through the imported content link. You will be able to review student submissions and then manually enter a grade in your Schoology gradebook. Documents are fillable PDFs that can be used digitally or be printed for in-person use. There are a few options for assigning and reviewing this type of activity. If you would like students to complete and submit a document on the learning site, you will use the File Upload Task Activity. You and your students can select to either download the document as a PDF or copy the link. Our documents are fillable as a download or when accessed in a browser window. If using a browser window, be sure to save your changes by selecting Save with Changes in Chrome or Export as PDF in Safari. Students can upload their completed document by selecting the Add File button. A text field with editing tools is available for additional comments or text entry. When ready, students will submit the activity by selecting the Submit button. You can also use Schoology functionality with our documents. If you would like students to complete and submit a document assignment in Schoology, you will create a Schoology assignment that allows for file uploads. 
You can have students directly access the assignment on the learning site, copy and paste the URL from the learning site to the Schoology assignment, or you can upload the document directly to the Schoology assignment. Your students will access the document, use the built-in fillable sections, save their changes, and then upload their work to the Schoology assignment. Documents completed as a file upload task activity can be accessed from the Imported Grades folder link. Inside the Grading and Feedback window, you can preview or access the student's completed work as a download or in a browser window. You can enter a grade and leave written, audio, or video feedback. If you set up the file upload task activity for grades passback, the scores will appear in the Schoology gradebook after a score is entered for the task in the Learning Site Reviewing window. If you assigned a document in Schoology, you will review student submissions using the built-in Schoology tools. You can access their submissions from either the gradebook by selecting the hyperlink title, or directly from the assignment. Then, use the built-in Schoology grading tools. If you ever need support, we offer many options. Our help icon, the question mark you see in the top right of the learning site, offers quick access to guides and links to our video tutorials, FAQs, and support center. We also have a few ways to contact us, automated chat, email, and phone. I hope this Schoology TCC integration overview was helpful. If you have any questions or would like more detailed information, please do not hesitate to reach out. Also, be sure to check out and subscribe to our YouTube channel, as well as follow Wayside Publishing on social media.